guys, there's a non-African tailor ever sold an African dress for you. You said what? Well, don't lie. Do not lie. Well, that is what I'm going to be doing, okay? In preparation for the Queer Week here in Dominica, I'm going to be sewing an African dress, not by an African tailor, but by a tailor here in the nature high of Dominica. Where is Dominica in the Caribbean? You get that? You feeling me? <laughs> anyway, guys, if you want to see how that's going to happen, keep watching. Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Precious Ayerinde. I film on faith, relationship, and lifestyle all the way from Dominica. <laughs> Please don't forget to subscribe if you haven't and don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up. Also turn on your post notifications so anytime I post, you get to see it immediately. So one faithful day while talking to my friend, I realized we both wanted an outfit for Dominica's Creole Day. So why not get it together? <laughs> we didn't find a lot of options in most of the stores compared to Africa where you know most you enter a store, you see a lot of options. So it took like another week for us to finalize on our choice of African fabric. We ended up going with this and the same thing because this has the colors of Dominica, virtually all the colors, green, yellow, white, and black. Well, if red is there, it's not dead yet. <laughs> so we got four yards each, making a total of eight yards. Now, to the tailor. <laughs> so I want to do something like this. This thing for yards to be enough, but I want to do the top and then skirt. Straight skirts with it, but this length of skirts. I don't know if the fabric is um, 16 inches large. Can you just check? Oh, mm -hmm. oh my You want to make it straight? You know, I'm not, I'm not big. Straight. Yeah, but I, I use normally three years can do top and skirts, right? Normally. Is this the same so, you? Yes, eight Bobo? years. Yeah. Bobo. So if there's extra from this one, you just add it in mind. Yeah. Precious. Yeah. Like normal precious. So you don't remember that it's me that's precious. Yeah. Jesus is yeah. not. You don't remember that precious is me. He has to write Steven's friend. Hey, let's look at that. The way she is now is too long. That's free, you know. You eat something already? No. But okay. I'll make it 20 <laughs> Most times I don't really eat, so just make it 28. 28 is fine. Yes. So I think the belt size should be around here. So, yes. So that would like 26. Okay. 27. Yeah, 28. 27 and a half. Yeah, 27 and a half is okay. So while taking my measurements, Stephen jokingly said he won't allow his future wife to be measured by a man. And I was like, what about when she's giving birth? And he was like, that's different. Let me know in the comment section if as a lady you feel awkward if a man is taking your measurements or if as a man you feel awkward if another man is taking your wife's measurements. For me, I don't see anything wrong with it. So far it's professional and everything is handled professionally. <laughs> then, um, your shoulders. Okay. So, that way starts to be smashed because that's how this dress will yeah. White, black, or yellow? Yeah. You have to do something about that. Huh? You have to do something about that. Uh, yes. Who we'll trying to? No, we didn't. Yeah. I bought the material. There is some bits. There is some bits. There we have to 150. 150? Of those. Not in the Dominica. That kind of that kind of clothes. Mm -hmm. uh, 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 um, they tax you 20, 20 man into me. No, you don't so close for me to see where they so what about me? It's you. Yeah. Okay. So guys, um, the thing now is I'm not sure how this is going to go. I'm wondering if 
a non-African tailor is going to be like an African tailor. You know African tailors, you know, like they used to sew in a lot of African dresses or outfits. You know this thing you know, they call Owambe, have you heard of Owambe before? Well, it's basically parties. There's always one party or the other in Nigeria. It's really the river culture, like, there's always one party or the other in Nigeria. So, they either used to like sewing a lot of these outfits and designing a lot of things. So, I'm wondering, is it going to be the same thing with a non African tailor who is not really used to doing things like this? Will they get it like to my taste? <laughs> so, I'm just hoping it goes well. But if you want to see that, just keep watching. Let's, let's go together. Let's do this, okay? <laughs> hi, 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 hi. So, I'm going to the tailor's place. I got an extra material, like the material for the design. So, that's why I'm editing so now. So, I called him earlier on while I was at the store to ask him how many years I should get, like half a year or even less than that. And I don't even know who was speaking to me. Maybe it was another person and I don't understand. That's what I'm saying, three years. Three years? Why is not the clothes I'm sewing? I don't know, buy material for the main clothes. Why three years? Anyway, I got it. So, hopefully, everything goes well. And it goes, comes out well. I just gave it to him. Guys, when I was losing my hair, I think I cut my hair twice or thrice. Once, the one of, at the back, I cut like a lot. Not, well, not a lot, but a bigger chunk of hair than, and I think, yeah, at the front of my head. So, but all good anyway. Uh -uh, why is my skin looking like it's glowing? <laughs> Don't be deceived, though. Don't be deceived. Now, I'll just tell the guy, the teller, to do a max for me with my material and also scarf. So I'm going to message you when I get them to do that. Let me go message them now. So once the Wi-Fi clicks, it goes, I don't forget. Good afternoon. <laughs> so today is Tuesday. I was in town yesterday. I went by the tailor's place yesterday, Monday. And yesterday I was just feeling some more. In fact, most of the things I came to do in town, I couldn't do them. I had to just go back home. So, but when I went to this place to like pick up the outfit, it wasn't done. Like the correction I made on Saturday, they did not fix it. Like they didn't do anything. So. When I went, I had to, you know, I want to start correcting it. I had to wear the clothes to show him again. Because the guy that I believe that sold it wasn't there on Saturday, so someone else was trying to correct it and all. But anyway, I couldn't wait. <laughs> I just did not want to stay in town. We are just not in a very good mood yesterday. So, today, this afternoon, I went there earlier on, like maybe about two hours ago. I already went there. I had to wear, it, wear the clothes again. And you needed to adjust a, a little bit. So I'm on the road. So you needed to just adjust the um, the ending part, the pencil part of the of the dress. So it was kind of too tight. Like I could not really work well with it. I made it to sew it to like to reduce it, so like make it narrower, but not too narrow that I can't even cross. If I see a cross, I can't cross. So anyway, I'm going back to pick it. Hopefully it's ready. I'm not going to try to take one and get there because I don't know how many times I've worn that dress <laughs> unofficially. So yeah, I'm going to just pick it up and we have some big place hopefully by your dress. Because I'm tired of it. <laughs> See you guys later. Thank you. So hopefully no complain. Okay, bye bye. So I just got it. I just got the you can see it. So once I get the mouse for you guys. So guys, 
guys, it's a wrap. Thank you for watching. So for my thoughts about this dress, I love the dress actually, um, but the down part of the dress wasn't lined. I just automatically expected him to line it, but that did not happen. So it's quite transparent. So I have to make sure I get to wear something um, just to ensure that it's not gonna show me, okay? <laughs> anyway, uh, apart from that, I like the dress. It took him like a week to do it. We gave him on Saturday and got it back on the next Saturday. I'm saying we because of course, Stephen also did his own. So for mine, I still had, you know, finishing touches there and there. So by Tuesday latest was when it was available for me to pick up. Maybe Monday if I had the patience to like, you know, wait on him to be to amend it. Well, apart from that, I think it was nice. Um, yeah, it's not matter. I won't complain with your dad, but people love the dress. I love the dress. I know you love the dress. You know, let me know in the comment section if you love the dress. And please, if you are yet to subscribe, what are you waiting for? Please click on the subscribe button below and also turn on your post notifications so anytime I post, you get to see it immediately. I really love it, guys. You know, I love the dress. I love how it makes me feel. So, guys, it's contact my main description box below or you can just message me on Instagram at Iron the Precious and on Facebook at Iron Precious. Anyone, I will see how it goes. So, yeah i'll give you guys you know information okay so if you're in dominica or in the caribbean or anywhere you want to just know have your african dress made or your african you know pants and top or whatever whether whatever you want to so basically you can check them out so i'll see you guys in the next one i hope you really, really enjoyed this video let me know by giving this video a what it sounds up so till i see you in the next one i still remain precious iron day from me to you it is bye Yes. <laughs>